Hello viewers, welcome back. So this is the part B of our 12th video as part of our series of video of our playlist, Power of Data Analysis. So in the last video, we just got introduced to the verification of balance and also we understood how this report is going to be useful for client as well as very critically for the auditors. So in this video, we will cover various techniques that we can apply to analyze the verification of opening balance. Let us go to tally and explore this option of verification of balance and understand various techniques. In this video, let us continue from where we left off. Remember, we had filtered to view only masters with balance mismatch by pressing Control F10. Let us understand the reports columns. There are four columns as we see here. The first column will list out the masters. The second column provides the information of opening balance for the current year. The third column represents the closing balance of the previous year, which is the finalized books of accounts. And the difference between the opening balance and the previous year closing balance in the fourth column, we see the difference amount. Now we have to analyze each ledger to identify the difference. We have two options here. Either we can select a group and drill down to view the ledger or by pressing shift enter we can explode the group at this level without drilling down. Let us take the first exception group that is current liabilities where there is a difference of 7552. The opening balance under this group is lesser by 7552. Select current liabilities and enter. Under current liabilities, sundry creditors group has the difference in opening balance. Select sundry creditors and press enter to drill down. We can notice that there is one ledger with opening balance difference. Like I had mentioned in my previous video, post audit ledger balances would have been finalized for the previous year. Also remember, I explained about the data splitting. The inference that we can draw with this exception is that the updated closing balance of the party ledger has not been modified in the current year books. Can we rectify the same from here? Yes. All you have to do is select the ledger where there is difference in closing and opening balance and press control enter. This will take to ledger alteration screen. We can come down here to the opening balance of the current year and change the balance as per the finalized previous year balance. I am not changing here. Let us see the other way of rectifying this difference. Come back. Now let us press shift enter to explode the group. Current liability is selected. Press shift enter. It will explode to the next level of subgrouping. Select the group of sundry creditors and press shift enter and tally will list only those ledgers under sundry creditors which has difference in the opening balance. Now select the ledger which has got difference in the opening balance and press control enter. We are back in the screen. Now come down here and enter the correct balance that is 202-252 enter and accept. If you notice now out of the four groups where there were difference in opening balance, the current liability difference under sundry creditors of one ledger since we have corrected the exception is vanish now. Let us take the next exception that is current assets. Press shift enter. Notice that even though current assets consists of other subgroups like cash in hand, bank accounts, sundry debtors, etc. is not appearing, tally will explode only the master which has difference. If you notice here the stock in hand the closing balance and opening balance, there is a difference of 6,400 rupees. If you recall, we saw this exception in verification of stock items. Let us go back and view the same. Select verification of stock items, enter and the second option not available in the current year which we saw, enter and notice that this stock item APC back UPS 600 VA, even though there is a closing balance in the previous year, 
but in the current year the opening balance is not captured the other stock items since they do not have any closing balance so opening balance is also not there if this mismatch or the exception once the balance is rectified from this report the same will not get listed in the difference in opening balance let us go back to verification of balance select enter and now let us filter only for exception remember the keyboard shortcut is control f10 the next exception is miscellaneous expenses asset notice here in the previous year the closing balance was 9000 rupees but whereas in the current year the balance is nil let us explode and see which ledger has this difference again press shift enter and we notice here the prepaid insurance ledger does not have opening balance which forms part of the balance sheet the reason for this is the prepaid expenses towards insurance was moved to this group under balance sheet in the previous year and ideally the accountant should have passed a journal entry in the current year and transferred the same to insurance expenses instead by mistake they have regroup the prepaid insurance to indirect expenses that is why this exception we will also understand the same amount of 9000 is reflecting under indirect expenses generally the opening balance for the current year will carry only the balance sheet items if you notice the next exception it confirms that the group has been changed and that is why in the current year revenue ledger has opening balance this again we saw in our verification of chart of account where we had an exception which was revenue ledgers having opening balance let us explode indirect expenses and see whether the same ledger has been moved to indirect expenses shift enter and you will notice that the prepaid insurance in the current year has been regrouped from miscellaneous expenses asset to indirect expenses that is why we see this difference in opening balance important information i would like to bring here to your attention is that this data analysis report will display the same type of exception in all related exceptional report like the prepaid insurance exception we are viewing here the other kind of analysis you can perform through this report is verification of balance variance how does this report help this report will now display closing balance of the current year in comparison with the closing balance of previous year to view the list of all masters where there is no opening balance difference also all you have to do is come to the right hand side button bar and just click on balance variance and we will get the list of all the ledgers where we can now see the first column lists out the list of all ledger masters in the amount column for the current year the closing balance of each ledger is getting displayed here along with the closing balance of these ledgers for the previous year and the last column basically gives you the variance amount along with the percentage this will help auditors to quickly get list of ledgers which are active and impacting current year balances let us take the example of consultancy charges notice here the closing balance of the previous year for consultancy balance was 25000 and in the current year the closing balance is 2 lakh rupees which means 1 lakh 75000 is got added to the consultancy charges which relates to 700% increase which means in the current year the company has earned more towards consultancy charges which means there is an increase of 700% in consultancy charges in the current year now you have an option to configure this report with additional information or filter the report so how do we do that press f12 configure and these are the configurations that we can modify if you want to see opening balance you can set it to yes if you want to view the transactions balances also you can set it to yes closing balance is already getting displayed if you want to see the name of the group since these ledgers are getting listed if you want to view the group you can click here and set it to yes with this option show ledgers with variance you can filter this report and view the report by specifying your 
criteria. Let us see how we can do that. So the variance type you can filter by amount or by percentage. So let us select percentage. Once you select percentage, now the range that you want to filter, you have this option equal to greater than or lesser than. So let us select greater than and say that you want to view only those ledgers where the variance is more than 500% for example. So just type 500, enter and you can save this configuration. Press Ctrl A and you will notice that out of the long list of ledgers, the variance where as per our criteria, that is you want to view only those ledgers with the variance greater than 500 and only four ledgers are getting listed. And based on this, you can use this information for further audit activity. This way, you can further enhance your analysis with the help of F12 Configure. I hope this report will be very useful for the client so that they can verify their opening balance carried forward from the finalized or audited books of account of the previous year. And also for auditors, it is going to be very helpful so that before they start the audit, they are going to first verify the balance of the opening balance matching with the previous year's closing balance. So thank you all once again for staying till the end. See you all in the next session. Thank you very much.